everyone, it's Matt Carl. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make your own Pokeball USB charger so you can keep catching those Pokemon on the go. So let's get started. So this charger is off Amazon. I'll link to it in the description below. It was around $10. I measured the dimensions off the charger with my calipers and then took to a 3D modeling program to actually make the Pokeball. I started with a sphere and then made a cut for the charger and then a larger cut for the Pokeball shape then added the clip on the back, and finally some colors. Now if you don't have a 3D printer, you can check out a website called 3D Hubs. It would take between $20 and $60 to get this printed by area, but you could also check out a local university or makerspace. But since I have a 3D printer, I loaded it into my slicer, added some support, and then loaded it to the 3D printer. Now this was a fairly long print, it took around 16 hours, but the 3D model that is linked in the description is a newer version I designed that has a lot less material in the center and should be cheaper and quicker to print. Again, links to everything is down below in the description. So once the print was done, I removed the support material, which ranged from fairly easy to frustrating, but sandpaper and needle nose pliers definitely helped, especially for the cavity where the USB charger is going to sit. I then lightly sanded the surface to prepare for painting and removed the logo from the face of the USB charger because I didn't really like how it looked. I then inserted the charger about 90% of the way into the Pokeball and added some hot glue to secure it in place. I used acrylic paint to add the colors, but you could just as well use spray paint to heck, maybe even crayons. Uh, probably not crayons, but I first applied a base coat of white to both halves and then a coat of red to the top. And then a coat of black on the inside rim. And here's the final result. Thanks for watching everyone. If you guys want to make your own Pokeball charger, I have the links to the charger and my 3D print files I designed in the description below. And if you guys like these tutorial videos, feel free to check out my channel and subscribe. I have plenty already up and more on the way. So thanks again.